All right, so we're doing more Linguini's Mansion 2 today. Um, I guess we're gonna try and finish up the, the first mansion. I mean, this game feels like it might take a while to beat. I mean, I'm not too sure yet. Because Luigi's Mansion 3 took me a while. It took me, like, I want to say, like, 14 or so episodes. So, yeah. Okay, there's my file. I have an hour and 35 into the game. And one boo. One boo. Doesn't keep track of your percentage. Anyways, uh, we got a new Luigi today. <laughs> Yeah, um, so I'm going to be doing what I did with Mario RPG Remake, where uh, I throw on a new skin every episode. Actually, I did that in um, Mario vs. Donkey Kong 2, I think. Yeah, so we're there's, there's just a bunch of Luigi skins on Game Banana, and I'm just going to throw on a bunch of different ones each episode, and eh, it's just for, for variety, you know? You know, variety's nice. Who doesn't love a good bit of variety? Anyways, we're gonna do, uh, A5. Something unexpected and gross has happened at the Gloomy Manor. It's been infested with spiders and they're re redecorating the place with sticky webs. It started suddenly and definitely not by natural means. At this rate, just walking around the place will soon become impossible. Get back to the manor post haste and suck up every last web with the Poltergeist 5000. Meanwhile, I'll try to figure out how this could have happened. Alright, time to get Luigi thrown into the TV again. Oh, why am I white and green now? This is weird. This is, uh, this is NES Luigi. Holy shit, there's 42 webs I gotta clean up? Damn, bro. That's a lot. Oh, hey, the coins in this respawn. That's nice. Well, where are the- where are they gonna be at, I wonder? Is there going to be some outside, or what? I still love the dynamic music. Oh! That clanking noise is from the frickin' gate. I was wondering what that was this whole time. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. I might just move my mic a little bit over here. I mean, moving your mic a few inches can make a world of a difference, you know? I don't think... That, well, actually, wait, hang on. I never went in this room yet, did I? I don't think I've been in this room before. Oh, I know I have. It's just for some reason I had to reactivate it for some reason. I just love when you accidentally repeat the same word twice. It's like, for some reason, it happened for some reason. <laughs> Won't lie, I, lo I do like this music. Eh. Oh, well, there's spiders, obviously. I gotta keep an eye out for all the spiders, then. Well... Can I not get- can I not get through this now? Oh. I just have to be a little quicker. Oh, that's nice. That's nice of Luigi to give me a little signal. It's like, yeah, you got all the webs in this room. Yay, a heart. You know, I don't usually play this game so late, but I figured why not. Oh man, I got harassed by a bat, bro. 
And I still can't, uh, I still can't get this, which is a big shame. Alright, it's time to go in this room then. And there's a whole lot of nothing in here. It's not really... Well, actually, it, it, it does mark where the webs are. But hey, man, I just want to explore. I want to have some fun. Let me have my fun. Okay, I'm guessing it's upstairs. Well, it's either up. Oh, there's a lot of them upstairs. Give me that money. Oh, or hearts. You think maybe uh, you should replace it with money if you're at full health? Well, that's a lot of webs. Um, is there anything I can do with this? Hmm. Bit weird, isn't it? Can I not do anything with this? Hmm. Burn. Burn the webs. Ow! Yeah, apparently Luigi's model is stored in something called a globals.arc. <laughs> it's amazing how much better this game can work when you actually have a proper, um, like, C-stick to work with. Because this game did not have a C-Stick normally. Which makes it, uh, kind of annoying to, eat, to do. Ooh, gold bars. Damn. Oh, hey. Cool gem. Look at that. So, are all of these gems in this one world? Or what? I don't know. Okay, it says there's a web in here somewhere. Up there. And another one I see up here. <laughs> hey, as room's a shit show. Okay, we'll worry about this room later. Can I suck this in? Maybe if I blow this fast enough, it'll, um, do something? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man. What if I need to blow it instead? Has there ever been a reason to, you know, blow instead of suck? <laughs> For lack of a better phrasing? Mm. Yeah, because right now I'm not sure. What's this floorboard all about? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to do about this. Until I get like... Until I get like some fire ability, I'm not sure. Hmm? <laughs> Alright, back in this room again. Pretty funny how similar um, the enemies in this game are to the Luigi's Mansion 3 ones. I'm not gonna be too talkative tonight. 
since it is a bit late. Well, I wouldn't say it's late, but... I don't know. I'm just not really feeling it too much. <laughs> I mean, originally we I was gonna play PvZ tonight, but that, that, that didn't ended up not happening. Kinda hard to nail these guys before they get away. I think the big problem people have with this game is that, um... Also, what's going on with this alarm clock? Is that just, is that just for show? Hmm. I feel like there's gonna be, like, a web behind one of these. Man, I'm getting, like, harassed by everything in here. Also... I use the... Yeah. There we go. I kind of forgot I have that. Also, I don't think I can use this door, no. Give me money. Is there anything weird here? <laughs> Frickin' rats. What does this do again? Uh, right, this lets me go in the fireplace. Hello? <laughs> well, it's clear there's nothing in here. Right, I, uh, I can't get through here. This room looks the same. Well, hang on, there's this. Am I supposed to light this on fire or something, maybe? Smart. I think this is. I think they're doing this is because they're teaching you um, that you have to do this for the boss. And that you can't burn. Or maybe you can, I don't know. Yay, money! Not a lot of money this level, though. So we have another room. We have the library, which uh, yeah, definitely has some definitely has some webs in it. That's for sure. Okay, is there any left in here? Maybe on the second floor. I don't know. I can't go back there. Yeah, I probably do need to go to the second floor. This has no webs. Which thankfully they're very they're very kind to line that out. Man, why is the music in this place like so calm? I'm not saying it's a bad thing, by the way. I like I. It sounds pretty chill, like a pretty chill home. <laughs> I, know, I dig it. Okay, well now I know what to do here, sort of. Oh wait, hang on. There's um, there's a ball up there. Uh, can I burn this? Ah, okay. And that also counts as, uh, that also counts towards it. So 
See, I'm big brain, guys. I'm getting big brain. Alright, go away. What does this do? Oh. Secret. Okay, that's that's the attic. Let me go up there later. Let me go back in here, because now I think I have an idea on what I need to do. Ah, okay. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We can also get the gem back here. And that's the mushroom. Or, I don't think that was the mushroom. I think that was like a diamond or something. So, if you're like trying to speedrun this game, it probably takes you like roughly, uh, like, I don't know, like three or three, three to five minutes per level. But obviously, I'm not, you know, that I'm not that smart. I'm playing the game for the first time. But that probably could be fun to try and 100% all the missions. I don't know if I'm gonna do that though. I'm not really that into the game. Oh, thanks for picking up that box. <laughs> Can I grab that? There's like an X that pops up. Where though? Oh, it's right here. Oh. <laughs> okay, you gotta you gotta balance. Oh. <laughs> there's a there's a good use of the motion, honestly. But I'm really bad at it. <laughs> the frickin' screams are great. There we go. That's cool. I, I don't mind that, actually. Okay, so this is how we get some fire. Oh, just get fire from the painting? Neat. So we weren't able to come up here in a previous mission, though. So now we're actually getting here for the first time. Cheese! Oh. I can't use that. And there's just a gem there. Okay, so I think there- I think the gems are per area. Not sure exactly how to unlock them yet, though. Oh, wait. Oh. Man, I hope they keep these puzzles up in the later mansions. Because these are really good. I do it. I good. I might have to look up a guide on where the gems are if I don't find them all. But I mean, that, that's pretty natural, I'd say. Oh, I have to go- I have to go back here? <laughs> and there a way I can go back? Like, easily? No. No, I don't think so. I think I have to go back the long way. Well, it was fun the first time, but not so much the second time. Anyways, let's play motion controls. Just keep the controller straight and you'll be fine. <laughs> In the frickin' box. Okay, well, we're down up here, so we good.
I heard the scare scraper mode for this game is pretty good though. Even though I probably won't get to play it. But it is good from what I know. Okay, so I have to I have to go the other way around for that room. So that's probably gonna be like one of the last webs that I get. Well, they make like little squeaky noises. And they hurt you too, that's funny. By the way, I believe... I believe that elevator is what takes you to the boss of this mansion. Which, uh... I already know what it is. I mean, I watched an all bosses video a long time ago when this game was new. Uh. But, uh, I forgot. I only remember a few bosses. Like, I know there's a weird one with a wall and a face. Um, I know there's, like, a giant knight. Um, the bats are killing themselves. Obviously, the boss of this world is a spider. I know that. Yeah, okay. Eat. <laughs> Surprised the fire doesn't hurt Luigi. Okay, there's uh, one more web that I'm missing somewhere. Where? Where's the last web? Is it like down or something? Am I dumb? Oh, yeah, yeah I am dumb. It is right here. And a free gold bar, because, you know, why wouldn't you want to grab a gold bar? Those guys give free stuff, too. I didn't quite get the other guy. Ow. <laughs> Damn. Bro, got me. Spiders. <laughs> why Luigi? Why Luigi do a little fist bump from revealing the spiders? <laughs> oh, that's fun. Yeah. Oh. Gold bone. Cause why the hell not, right? <laughs> Wait, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Okay, some more extra extra money, yeah. We got Chill Linguini's Mansion tonight. Okay, I see the last web. And the last web here. That was a pretty fun mission. Well, what do I do now? Oh, he just calls me. Good work, Luigi. The spiders should have leave now that you removed the webs. Any or more pressing issues come up. I may have discovered where the spiders came from. I'll bring you back now to fill you in. Ciao. Gonna be like a bronze, probably. Yeah. Look how much gold I got. <laughs> He's freaking whistling the music.
You want me to? If you want me to freaking uh, get gold stars in every mission, you're crazy. But hey, maybe someday. I wouldn't say no. I'll keep my save file just in case. Glad to see you back, Sunny. Did you capture any ghosts? I got some new gems. Three of them would be actually four new gems. And I think we have just enough. No, we're nine gold short, damn it. While you were cleaning out all the webs, I made an important discovery. There's an incredibly strong paranormal signal coming from in deep within the manor. Now I'm not sure what it is or how it managed to evade Periscope's radar for so long, but I reckon it's somehow connected to the spider infestation. Unfortunately, pinpointing the signal hasn't been the easiest of tasks. But as soon as I find the darn thing, I'm sending you in after it. Get your game face on, Sonny. Hmm. So, the fact that there's a like icon next to these implies that there is a boo in every level. Also, yeah, we're about to do the boss. Eureka, I've cracked it. I triangulated the most powerful paranormal signal, and it's coming from the cellar. Aww. Aww. Yep, the cellar. Scared, can't say I blame you. Sellers do have a terrible reputation. But I believe in you, Luigi. Once we find out who or what is behind this mess, we'll put a stop to it. So button up those overalls real tight and get ready for action, my boy. Now get to the cellar. You'll need to take the elevator. It's pretty straightforward, but I'll mark the cellar on the dual screams map just in case. Oh yeah. The dual screams map. This key should open the elevator, though I imagine the elevator's operating permit may have be expired. Oh well, I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> okay then, I'll be tracking your progress from the relative warmth and the comfort of this bunker. Ready or not? I time to become Minecraft again. Wow, my phone charged to 50% really quick. <laughs> okay, to be fair, it has been almost half an hour, but still. Oh, we just get thrown straight at the start of the elevator. I mean, hey, at least they're cutting down on the filler, you know. Alright, let me get my money so I can level up after this mission. Yay, bills! 50 bucks, like, right away, you know? I do it. Oh, yeah, that elevator music's great, by the way. Hello? Hello? <laughs> I'm sure everybody knows by now, but, uh, that is the Mario Strikers pause music. So, uh, pretty cool. I love that they reference their game. Oh man! I was trying to get the, uh... Trying to get... Okay, I guess we're not getting that. Can I get it from up here? Okay, I guess not. Yeah, I got an idea. There we go. Bit cryptic for just 15 coins, but hey, whatever, I won't complain. This game can be, uh, this game can be dark when it wants to be. I 
got scooters. Oh, my, I'm gonna need that later. Can I, can I not grab that? see coins back there. Oh, I think I need to grab this. Oh, here we go. Here's the boss. Alright, well, time to find out how to fight this boss. What's this? What, why is our next here? Oh. Nothing I can't examine. Hmm. Do I have to, like, sneak up on it or something? <laughs> I am almost dead already. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Well, that went well. <laughs> okay, I can't even freaking beat the first boss in the game. Okay, well, you know, I'm gonna say screw the money this time. Yeah, screw the money. I'll just fight. I'll just try and fight the boss. So what am I supposed to do then if I can't grab that? Plus the boss does a lot of damage too. Doesn't help. Oh, well, there's something up there. I can't quite access that though. Can I, is there a way I can, like, acquire this fire somehow? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just gonna ignore the boss, then. How about that? I'll get this money. At least I know I'll level up after this one. Can I, can I suck this purple goop up? No. The fuck are you supposed to do here? Oh, well, the heart is appreciated. Hmm, am I supposed to go around it? Can I use... Can I flash it? Oh, I thought I was supposed to... Yeah, I'm supposed to flash it with a flashlight. Yeah, I'm dumb. <laughs> How can I forget about flashing the boss? There's a ghost inside? <laughs> There's a ghost possessing the spider. I don't remember there being bosses inside these enemies. And while you're doing that... I was gonna... I was gonna say I should, uh... 
Oh, hey, I can use this now. Can I not use this? Oh, you know what? I was always supposed to shoot. I'm supposed to, yeah, use the fan. Come on over here. I can't use the fire here. This is as far as I can bring it back. Weird. Boss gets stunned for a surprisingly long time, I can say that. <laughs> Whoa. Oh yeah, see I can't uh, I can't pull it back that far. Ow. Am I supposed to like Use this to burn it, maybe? Maybe. I mean, I think that's the idea. Bro, every time I- every time I fucking blow it... Can it not reach over here? Why else would this be here? Maybe I need to blow it enough. There we go. Okay, there we go. And then I need to get back over there in time before the fire goes out. Is that what I'm supposed to do? I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Oops. <laughs> it doesn't stay on fire for very long, does it? Am I supposed to... Hmm. I have an idea, actually. <laughs> I did something. I was gonna I was gonna ask if I can pull this ball and let it get caught by that thing. I don't know. <laughs> this boss is a puzzle in itself. <laughs> hmm. Well, is there anything else I can do? Hello, anything else that I can do? Oh, I the only other thing I can think of is am I supposed to light this on fire and then run to the other side? That's the only thing I can think of. But I don't know if I can do that in time. It's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna, like, go out by the time I get back, yeah. Wait, I mean, I have an idea. I have an idea. Big brain moment number two. <laughs> what if I, what if I let this get caught by the night guy? No, don't fucking let go of it. Hang it.
<laughs> Those damn spiders keep getting in my way, bro. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So now that it's stuck there... There. There we go. That's the reason why that... That's the reason why that armor is there. Thanks for the health. Ow. <laughs> that was my bad, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, so now there's like a completely different puzzle. Well, what's the puzzle then now? Obviously, I gotta bring this with me. Hmm, okay, this gives me an idea. He's trying to like, he's trying to like, tuck me. <laughs> oh, bro. <laughs> You've gotta be fucking kidding me. Okay, well, I mean, at least the, uh, at least the pillars are still there, so now I know what to expect. Come on, Lee, don't drop it. I think I need to press L2. Bro. Oh, you know what? I'm stupid. I'm supposed to burn that. Jeez, I'm running out of health. Hopefully I won't die. Okay. Give me health, please. Got a bit more health. Okay. I'd argue this third phase is easier than the first phase. Okay, well, it's not easy when the spiders are, like, on my ass. <laughs> there. Got him. Yeah! I got my first boss ghost. Oh, I'd be fine if you died from the frickin' spider after you beat the boss. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Luigi put in his butt. Friendly Spooter now. <laughs> we confronted the source. Remarkable, a ghost that can possess other beings. Unless my eyes are going, the Possessor had a piece of the Dark Moon inside himself. Oh, by the way, are you okay? That was a pretty intense scuffle. But you and the Poltergeist 5000 really showed that boss ghost who's boss. I'm sure you're tired after that fight. I'll bring you back now.
Oh yeah. <laughs> How long did that boss fight take? Eleven minutes. <laughs> oh boy, I, I I took a lot of damage in that fight. Wow, all that, and we're, we're already at 46 minutes. <laughs> yeah, I mean, despite the mission structure, those missions are pretty damn long. <laughs> well, I mean, they range from like 10 to 20 or so minutes. <laughs> Luigi, my boy, what a fight. You really use your noggin to teach that ghost a lesson. Let's take a look at that body snatcher ghost. Yeah. Interesting guy. Yay, I level up. Upgrade. So we got Poltergeist level 2 now. When vacuum out a ghost, you'll be able to charge the power gauge longer. Weaken the ghost even more when you press A. That is nice. Fantastic. Now that we've recovered another Dark Moon piece, we just need to find the rest of them. <laughs> uh... What was that? You thought we were done? <laughs> you didn't think the ghosts would keep all the pieces in the same place, did you? No, these ghosts are far too crafty for that. They've likely spread the pieces across the entire valley. Anyway, let's inspect that piece of the Dark Moon. Take a dump now. Criminy, just like the other one. This thing is covered with the same corrupting energy. But it's nothing a good scrubbing can't fix. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. We get to go to the next area. Now my suspicions are correct. Yes, more of that creepy fog is lifted. Maybe the periscope will be able to locate some dark moon pieces now. Let's take a gander at the map and see what shakes loose. Yeah, now we unlock the next mansion. From what it looks like, there's like... Six or so mansions? I don't remember how many mansions are in this game, actually. Ooh, that's it! That's where we've gotta go next! How are we getting there, you ask? Well, I thought it might come to this, so I made a couple of tweaks to the pixelator. I should now be able to move you to the next location. Check it out on the, no on the monitor. Yep, so we can go from Gloomy Manor... ...onto Haunted Towers. These remarkable towers are built around a colossal tree. The original owners had a liking for gardening and exotic plants. Oh yeah, there is a garden. There is a gardening level in uh, Luigi's Mansion Three as well. That's kind of neat. So yeah, from what it looks like, um, yeah, there's a shit ton of gems I missed. I don't know if I'm gonna go for them or not. We'll see. I mean. The more I get through this game though, right, the more I'll end up enjoying it. So naturally, by the time I get to the end of the game, I probably will want to go back and get all the gems. So, yeah. That's crazy. There's like a shit ton of gems for every area. A job for a plumber. Okay, I think I'm going to take a small break. But uh, after I take my break, I will... Be back, and we will do the next level. Alright, so I actually have a, a topic idea. Thought of a few things, which uh, I'll get to. Our quest is taking us to a new location, Luigi. Aren't you excited? <laughs> no, I'm not excited. No? Oh, come on, where's your sense of adventure, son? Our work is far from done. 
We need to get a handle on those ghosts, so who knows how far they'll spread. And there's only one way to fix this mess. Restore the dark moon and place it back up in the sky. So... From what it looks like, there's four more shards. So does that mean there's five more... There's four more mansions? I don't know. You know what? I, might, I mean, I might as well spoil myself and get an idea of how long this game is. Um... How many, how many mansions are in Luigi's Mansion 2? Yeah, yeah, it knew what I was talking about. Mm, okay. It says Luigi's Mansion 2 is broken up into five different mansions with three to five missions, a boss, and a bonus mission. And each mission has a hidden boo. Interesting. So, in total, there are like roughly 25 levels. There's actually not that many missions per mansion, I'm surprised. I guess to be fair though, each mission each mission does take like 20 minutes on average on your first playthrough, so... Yeah, it's not bad, it's pretty long still. My periscope is located the next piece somewhere in these haunted towers. They've been abandoned for some time now, so they're teeming with exotic plants and naturally ghosts. The towers are in bad shape, and the water system seems to be broken. If only we had a plumber around here. You see, the haunted towers feature a complex water system that powers all the machinery. So the first thing on your to-do list will be to check the hydro generator. <laughs> Luigi stink. That could be a good emoji, honestly. <laughs> Oh, and keep an eye out for new types of ghosts. That goes without saying. Good luck, young feller. So yeah, uh, I have some potentially good news for the month of October. Um, by the end of October, I would like to get an SSD finally for my computer. I've been I've been uh, kind of looking at like cheap SSDs because uh, you know it's just it's just crazy that I've gone my whole life without one and. Uh, you know, I think it's fine the time I get one. Also, uh, this place does look very natural, I guess you could say. Dang. <laughs> Amazing how detailed Luigi's mustache is in this game. It's like one of the most detailed mustaches ever. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if they literally just ripped the the, ma the Luigi's Mansion model from Luigi's Mansion 3. Anyways, that's but that's besides the point, though. <laughs> oh wow! But yeah, um, I'm getting I'm getting some YouTube money by the end of this month, so I'm gonna try and use that money to, um, get myself an SSD. And, uh, then my computer can stop being a slow piece of shit. <laughs> okay, bro, bro, bro screwing around with the, the switch there. Can I go in the, can I go in the vent? Can I be a crewmate? I gotta figure out how to get in. Hmm. But I don't exactly know how to open the gate. I feel like this I feel like this vent is important somehow. Hmm. Is there anything else I can mine? Maybe I need to... Hmm. Oh wait, hang on, I got an idea. Ah. Oh, there we go. I keep forgetting that I can flash. Flash the flowers. That might be how I get one of the gems back in the gloomy manor. It's 
So they're teaching now. They're so now they're teaching us that you can flash these flowers, and they open up if you do. Hmm. What do I do with this? Okay, I clearly wasn't supposed to do that. <laughs> Yay, more money! Can I shoot it at the gate? Okay, that did not that did not help. <laughs> I don't know, that might be useful for something. Yeah, just dig up all the flowers. Yo, what's up, Nucleus Ghost? Oh, hey, it's got it's got the same theming as uh, the last mansion. Are all the are all the mansions going to do that? I don't know. Good question. Oh, yellow. Mmm, just as I feared. The hydro generator seems to be in a good condition, so the water pump must be clogged. Why don't you check the water supply on the roof? Oh, key. We got a barrel, which has nothing in it. So I wonder where, um... I've been missing booze then, clearly, because I haven't been looking very hard. So I wonder where the booze are at. Hmm. Golden mice! Except, the mice don't actually give anything. Hmm. I'm not too sure what to do with that. Clearly I'm supposed to be able to do something, though. Either that or maybe I'm just making up shit. Frogs? Froggy, what are you doing in this mission? Ghost frogs. <laughs> I don't remember those guys being in uh, any other Luigi game. You wanna help me out, Barrel? Supposed to, you know what? There's probably supposed to be a freaking bridge here. Okay, maybe not. Luigi can't climb up there either. Am I crazy? No, oh, there is. There's dead ass nothing here. Oh wait. Oh, there's a door here. Yeah, if a door, if, if a room looks suspicious, just use that. Oh, this is, this is a real, this is like hella, hella Luigi's Mansion 3 right here. <laughs> Those freaking ghosts be trolling, man. Is there anything I can use here? No. Oh. <laughs> I just broke some pottery. Hope you guys don't mind. Ah. I knew there was something here. Oh, bro, bro is shielding himself. Give me that shovel. Wow. 
There we go. The supercharge is only gonna really work on a few enemies, though. Oh, it charges up longer. I see how it works. So it'll be more useful on the red guys, because they take more health. <laughs> if there's one thing I'm glad they brought back, it's Luigi humming. <laughs> That's just the lay motif of this game. I mean, it's a it's a good one. So far, I haven't found any um, I haven't found any things yet. Like um, oh, hang on. Look at all that. Look at all those hearts. Yikes. Yeah, so I guess I should point out that I have started watching Sailor Moon Season 3, or Sailor Moon S, as it's called. I only watched, like, the first few episodes. But I have gotten introduced to, um... You know, the new Sailor Scouts. <laughs> Which, uh... I'm gonna have fun learning about them. <laughs> oh. So that's where those come in handy. Lee, you're so proud of himself for killing ghost plants. Hey. And ghost plants. Oh wait, hang on, I got an idea. And I destroyed this. Yeah. Is there anything else I can destroy? Nope. Doesn't look like it anyway. Ugh. Man, this is the, another burping stream. What is the point of that? I don't know, but I guess I activated that. Anything secret? No. Hey, look, it's the Bat Company. I know those aren't bats, those are like ravens. He's got a shit ton of ravens. That's pretty ri that's pretty dangerous. Is that gonna be the boss? A frickin' uh, Raven? Raven Company? <laughs> yeah, I see, uh, I see a gem there. What is all, what is all this? Oh yeah, there, see, now I can take those guys out in one hit. Ow. <laughs> I got caught. I got cocked by a freaking ghost, dude. Oh my god, you gotta be shitting me. There's a lot of there's a lot of ghosts in this room. Get over here, bitch. Bro! Ah, 
I am fucking dead. I got bullied by the ghosts. No, I have to redo the whole ass mission. Are you serious? Whoa. Well, that's not fun. Um, I'm gonna cut this part out, actually. Alright, so it turns out there's a frickin' uh, hole right there where that carpet is supposed to be. That's pretty dumb. <laughs> I didn't know that. Oh, yeah, but let's, uh, well, let's get through here. Or at least try to. Okay, let's not get screwed over by the ghosts this time. Oh, okay, the, the, the gold mice, they drop, uh, gold bars if you flash them. last time. <laughs> there we go, that wasn't wait, that wasn't too bad. I didn't take that much damage this time. Oh I got a ping. Hey I haven't even I haven't even updated my diary yet. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Since, uh, since Zeppi's reminding me, I need to turn off the, uh, everything is instant mod. <laughs> I need to turn that shit off. Because, um, yeah, that mod, it's kind of busted. <laughs> if you guys haven't been keeping up with the trash rebuff videos, we've been playing this mod called, uh, everything is instant. And it's kind of, it's like kind of a turbo mode. What was the point of that? <laughs> you gotta have problems. Major, the substance stuck in the Poltergeist 5000. Why don't you create a balloon with it? Use ZL and ZR to inflate and deflate. The air coming out of the Poltergeist might just be hot enough to let you lift off. Oh. Okay, I'm I'm bad at this apparently. Do I have to hold both of them or what? Nope. Ah, look at that. Oh. Okay, I, I got the idea. Oh, you can you can hold ZR to like change your direction. That's pretty neat. And I can just keep it in. Can I can I jump with this? I don't think I can blow it up here. Can I use it here? That's a fun, that's a fun gameplay mechanic, I won't lie. Balloon plants. 
I mean, that's not something I would have guessed, honestly. Good on them for introducing new mechanics, too. Because I know for sure that isn't in the third game. <laughs> Chat member says, why do you need to blow after you suck? <laughs> What's the point of this? Can I even activate this? Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> I'm not sure what I'm doing here. <laughs> Spooky bucket. We got a frickin' bucket head. This guy thinks he's playing PvZ. <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> Okay, so why I'm supposed to put the bucket on uh, one of these? Maybe. One bucket, John. Sit on the switch. I don't think that, I don't think, it, I don't think it's working. It's not like fully on the, it's not like fully on there for some reason. Am I supposed to use this stuff? I need to fill the bucket up. Oh. Well, let's do that first. Okay. Okay, so now, now it'll open up. There's a problem though. I still can't activate all of these at once, so I need to put Bucket Chan over here. Oh, I guess it doesn't want to. There we go. So what if I activate both of these at once? There we go. Thanks, Bucket Chan. <laughs> I don't know why it's called Bucket Chan now, but that's just that's just what we're calling it. And yeah, so we'll get those gold bars. The froggies are having fun. So now we can actually, like, get into the damn mansion. This entire first level was just getting to the mansion. <laughs> or getting inside the mansion, rather. Oh. Hello. Fantastic job, youngster. The water flow is slowly normalizing. Hold on, I'll pixelate you out of there in a minute. No, I wanted to get those gold bars, you get. <laughs> You cuck. Wow. Oh, is there gonna be a goo monster? Honestly, I don't even remember what voice I gave Egad for Luigi's Mansion 3. But yeah. <laughs> 
It's the Nico Kato ghost. Which is what I would say, but except that's not Nico Kato anymore. So I need a new fat person to make fun of. I think I got that level up. Am I right? Ow. Bro, bro stomach punched me. But yeah, before I kill him, let me go get these gold bars real quick. <laughs> That is quite literally a stomach punch. Yeah, it's it's the it's the Nikocado that died, so that we could have skinny Nikocado. <laughs> He's throwing his fat self away. <laughs> oh, good job dealing with that rather rotund ghost. I'm bringing you back. Hold on to your hat. Yeah, because according to, according to the TTYD remake, you're not allowed to call people fat anymore, <laughs> which uh. That's a bit, uh, subjective. Oh yeah, it's Mr. Lugs. I remember him. Well, if anybody wants to, I, I do have a Luigi's Mansion 1 playthrough that I did a year or two ago. I did the, uh, PAL Hidden Mansion. Which, uh, was a lot of fun. I had fun, uh, playing through the Hidden Mansion for the first time. The real Hidden Mansion. Not the fake-ass one that we got in the West. <laughs> Where you just do double damage, which is like super lame. Great job, Luigi. Let's see that ghost. Yeah, stick your dick in the vacuum. He's 42 pounds. Actually, I don't know what W stands for. No, it doesn't increase the HP, you just do 1.5 times the damage, <laughs> which is like the lamest thing. You do more damage, the enemies do more damage, that's the only difference. But the PAL version, it adds new treasures, new ghosts, the mansion is mirrored, and uh, the bosses are different, which is what I like. That's exactly what I want to see in a you know hard mode. And apparently they carry that over to the 3DS version, but the 3DS version is dog shit. Because it runs at like 20 FPS half the time. So, no, don't play that version. <laughs> Good job restoring the water flow. If this whole ghost hunting thing doesn't work out, you may have future as a plumber. <laughs> yeah, Luigi quit that shit to become a ghost buster. Well, the bosses aren't new. The bosses just have new attacks, is what I meant to say. You'll be happy to know that the Haunted Tower's water system is now almost completely functional. <laughs> it's fully operational, <laughs> I guess you could say. I also have news regarding the Dark Moon piece. How did you take a look? You're looking a little soggy. Or take a break. <laughs> I mean, I did just take a break earlier before I played this mission. The Pinwheel Gate. Yeah, it is better. Um, so I think this will be my last mission tonight. But yeah, you know, I'm trying to get in. I'm trying to get into the flow of Luigi's Mansion, you know. Because here's the thing: when I played um, Luigi's Mansion three, if like three or four years ago, um, it started out pretty rough. I, I was kind of getting frustrated with the game, not knowing how to do the puzzles and stuff. But once I got, like, I want to say, like, halfway through the game, I was, like, getting into it. And then I was doing, like, two to three hour episodes once I got into it. So, it's going to take me some time to kind of ease into this game. So that's why I'm kind of keeping episodes short at first, and then eventually we'll get nice longer episodes. <laughs> Luigi, want to hear the news about the Dark Moon piece? Well, the Periscope was having a heck of a time trying to pinpoint its location. But then it hit me, I can analyze the Dark Moon piece we already have to improve the precision. <laughs> you guys are the kind of guy who'd use fucking chat GPT. <laughs> it's like, oh no, you guys are using fucking chat GPT again, how could you? Naturally I was right, and after the little tinkering, the periscope produced better results. 
Remember that gigantic tree? The dark moon piece seems to be somewhere up there. So we know roughly where it is, but the hard part is getting there. <laughs> You're 60. I can't believe Toadsworth died before Egad did. This is, it is just, you know, insane. You need to cross the newly raised bridge and explore the interior of the hollow tree to find a way up. <laughs> the hollow tree? I guess we really are playing Terraria after all. Got all that? Off you go. Oh shit, I gotta become Minecraft again. Toadsworth had a good life. He got to go, he got to go baseball, party. Um... He got to go on vacation. <laughs> Luigi got his foot stuck in a bucket. Hey, I mean, at least he didn't get his dick stuck in a bottle. Because <laughs> that could have been bad. I don't know if there's anything else we need to do out here. Come here, Bat. Bat, where'd you go? Oh, that Bat is just gone. Okay, so I don't think there's much else to do out here. Blue guy. I mean, obviously, Luigi's Mansion 2 wasn't built in mind with, uh, widescreen, because, you know, it was a 3DS game originally. Okay, those guys are just pissing off, apparently. Aw, oh, man, I can't work the door with just one piece. Wait, one piece? Aw, oh, shit, it's an anime moment. Oh, yellow. Kremini, not again! That pinwheel gate won't open without its veins. Did you see where those skinny bastards went? Never mind, I'll use the periscope to find them. Hold on a sec. Got him, check your map! Oh. They went inside this door. Oh, the door that I, c I couldn't open last time. Wait a minute, wasn't there a thing here last time? Yeah, I knew it. Secret. Yay, more money. You have to, like, really pay attention to the environment. Alright. Give me money, give me money, give me money. Hey, look, there's a door right here, too. I like these freaking squeaky orbs that I have to suck in. No, I'm not getting cocked by the freaking shovel ghost again. Wow, bro, bro, like, hit me. Nope. I do wish there was a bit more, uh, Ghost Friday in this game, though. I mean, at least there's been a couple new ghosts every now and then, but... There's not enough. <laughs> yeah, you're not- you're not going in there. You can press B to dodge? <laughs> huh. Where has that been all this time? <laughs> Ooh, we got fire. Spooky. Very nice looking room there. Uh... 
There's just no flower there, apparently. Yeah, mow the lawn! Dang, I can't believe I already had to use one of my mowers. <laughs> some parts too. Bro, bro, bro really went. Ow. Okay, hang on, let me try jumping then. Oh yeah, you can jump. I guess I should be using that more often. <laughs> yeah, less less backseating is good unless I get like stuck for like half an hour or something. <laughs> hmm, I see a boo there. How do I how do I interact with that boo though? Those boos are really freaking hidden, I tell you. I haven't found a single boo since that one episode. Can I shoot a bucket at the boo? Nope. <laughs> Hello, boo. Can you come out, please? Here. Hey, I mean, you know, worst case scenario, we can always come back here later in the game and we can get these boos on like a cleanup run, you know? And then I can look up how to get them, is what I'm thinking. Oh, yeah, I don't think there's any way to get this boo right now. Doesn't seem to want to collect itself. So. Unless I can mow the lawn some more. No. Huh, the fire in there is blue now. Spooky. Funny boo names. <laughs> and there's a lot of spinning doors in this game, I noticed. Game in it. This game has an obsession with that so far. Can I, uh, can I get up there? Yeah. No, oh, you're a bitch. I mean, in my opinion, the, uh, the simplicity of the Luigi's Mansion 1 combat, I don't think will ever be matched, because there's something so satisfying about it, just the simplicity of it. <laughs> Greenies, hiders, gobbers, and slammers. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. I, I remember Greenies, but I didn't know the other guys. I mean... The Luigi's Mansion 3 ones are oh, they're a little better, like Goob. Okay, I just got trolled. The only one I remember is Goob, because it sounds stupid. Two more guys. I mean, I saw the Polter the Poltergust guy, or Poltergeist? Yeah, Poltergeist guy. I saw that guy pretty, uh, I saw that guy in the first episode. Okay, I'm apparently doing something wrong. There we go. Huh? Okay. 
more moon me. Well, we have a bucket here. I go away, bucket. Yay, more money. Am I supposed to keep doing this? Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do. Okay, let me try that again. Dang it, so close. Come here, Bucket. Come here, Bucket Chan. Get in the right place. There we go. Perfect. Not sure what I'm supposed to do with this water, though. But I have a bucket of water. Hmm. Hey, I mean, there's a bunch of money back here. Is the water is the water bucket gonna like drain out or something? Hmm. Well, there's also this. All of this like. Hmm. Oh yeah, there's like a there's like a missing pipe there. Can I water this thing, or is it just stuck? I don't know, honestly. <laughs> Can I water this? Oh, there we go. Oh, that's for a gem, though. <laughs> What else do we have here? Oh, oh! Man, I could've used that, like, earlier in the last mission. Hmm. Is there a secret door here? Or something? Oh, wait. Here we go. See, I mean, eventually you will figure out the puzzles. So I actually did the treasure before the actual puzzle. Rare case where me fucking up actually helped. Uh, not really creative with the poltergeist name there, huh? Yo, it's a sta- Yo, it's the frickin', um... It's the staircase before the Maru Key fight in Persona 5. <laughs> where you go up that giant tree. Give me that shit. Bro's got glasses. Bro thinks he's so smart. He thinks he's hot shit. I mean, yeah, I've never been big on the new Luigi's Mansion ghost design, but... Where I think Luigi's Mansion... Um... Like, the new Luigi's Mansion games really excel at are the puzzles. Like, the puzzles and the exploration are way more fun than the first game. But I think the first game has better combat and better, like, environments and ghost designs. So, the Luigi's Mansion games, they have, they have different, like, vibes, you know? Can I suck any of this up? Oh, there's a, there's a blue guy in here, obviously. Hey, Diddy, they suck it up. <laughs> yeah. Anything else I can interact with here? There's mice. Ooh, more money. I saw. Oh, I saw a rat back there. Come here, rat. I'm gonna just chill over here. How will I, how do I get that rat to show up again? Rat, come back. Will he, he show back up if I just sit around?
I'm gonna get that rat to show back up. Fuck. Dang it. Too slow again. Come back, Mr. Mouse. Bro really doesn't want to get flashed, I guess. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to go up here. Fuck. I, I don't know if this is what I'm supposed to do, but... <laughs> okay, he didn't show up that time. Well, now it's not strong enough. <laughs> Is that not what I'm supposed to do? What about this? What, what can I do with this thing? Oh. <laughs> I'm supposed to shoot at it. Now, I, li I liked my method better. <laughs> I liked my method better of just running and, sh and blasting it with the flashlight. <laughs> All right, that's two of the the many gems in this place. I mean, you think uh, you think we need to give like dark energy to this tree and give it human energy? <laughs> Bat. Dang it, I missed the bat already. So I learned recently that if you shoot the go the gold enemies with the flashlight, you get money. Which is very weird, because in the other game, in Luigi's Mansion 1, you, you just, you know, suck them in the vacuum and then you get it. But no, you have to specifically flash them to get the money. Which is very strange, if you ask me. Bro's, ha bro's having fun on that vac- or... Yeah, he's gonna have fun in my vacuum. Alright, come here. Oh man, that upgrade is helping so much with those guys. Come here. Out, bro. How do I make him come out? Yeah, I'm just gonna keep playing the piano. Isn't that organ? Isn't that organ great? <laughs> what if I? Uh... What else can I do with this organ? Hmm. Weird. Well, I can't, I can't, like, activate my vacuum in time. That's the, or I can't activate my flashlight in time, that's the problem. Hmm. Well, that's weird. Maybe I'll figure it out, I don't know. Maybe I gotta go behind it or something. <laughs> Is there anything behind the organ?
Like I use the dark light. <laughs> Bro, I'm so confused. I can't flash him fast enough. The fuck do I do? Oh, and also apparently I missed a guy on F1. <laughs> I'll have to go back for that. Hmm. I'm just gonna leave. Is there like a way I can check this shit? Hmm. Maybe there's something I'm missing, I don't know. I could blow out all the torches. I'm not sure if that helps in any way. Yeah, are the torches are the torches just coming back? Yeah, they are. Hello. Hello. Oh, now he decides to get flashed. Now nah, this is really finicky then. <laughs> okay, so now we're out here. Which I don't know if I'm supposed to even be here yet. <laughs> That's, that's my face, after all these puzzles. <laughs> hey, maybe now that I'm, you know, doing a playthrough of this, maybe when I'm done with this, I can watch uh, Chaga Conroy's Dark Moon playthrough. Who knows? That'd be pretty cool. So I think this is as far as I can go for now. Can't even get in there. Yeah, so my dumbass missed a thing on the first floor, so I gotta go all the way back down now. Hmm. Guess we'll go back inside. I mean, unless it's not like there's a shortcut down there. You know, just for just for a good old time's sake. That was fun. Well, guess we're going back down to the first floor again. Don't know how I missed that. Where am I? Where, which floor is it? What floor am I on right now? I'm on like the first floor, right? So we gotta go back here. D yeah, we're in the tool shed. Okay, that's a dead dead ass. I just decided not to come in this room. I thought it'd be a great idea, but I missed out on this. Hey, look, another bucket. Oh, he's gone now? Okay, what can I- what can I even do with this balloon? Is there, like, a secret? What's the point of this? Can I, uh... Can I hop on the bed? Every bed so far I've been able to go on. Oh! 
This is a completely different bed. Hello? 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 Supposed to put a water bucket on here? Yeah, that makes sense. So this is the gardener's lab. I don't know if I'm gonna need that bucket for anything. Oh shit, he, he's spitting out more ghosts. Ooh, the, I think my flash is also bigger. Damn, I just got like four gold bars for that. Man, I'm rich. Yeah, I'm eating all that paper. Mm, nothing I can interact with here. Oh, I can't, uh... Can I grab the balloons? I don't think that's gonna help me. <laughs> so what can I do here? I've been having a lot of fun modding uh, Mario Party Jamboree so far. <laughs> But so far, um, we need to figure out how to, um, open the BEA files, because we don't know that yet. So until we figure that out, we're not going to be modding dialogue or textures or anything cool. <laughs> Can I flash him? Unless there's, like, something hidden. Oh. Okay, well, don't do that. Is there something in here? No. What about in here? Oh! Funny ghost guy. Oh, okay. What's the point? What's the point of this guy then? He's just there. Okay. Oh. Hello. Good job, Luigi. That was the last vein for the pinwheel gate. I'll bring you back here so we can figure out how to reinstall them. Oh yeah. That's gonna be like the worst ranking of all time. 25 minutes for that mission, bro. <laughs> hey, I mean, at least I got a gem or two. Yeah, so the thing is, is the BEA files, I can't open them with the BEA editor for some reason. It just gives me an error message, so... I'm hoping somebody can crack it on launch day. <laughs> That'd be great, and then I can start doing my texture and text edits for that game, and that'll be really fun. Good job scaring those ghosts out of their hiding spots, young feather. Two new gems, and a lot of money, too. <laughs> God damn, I almost got the next upgrade already. <laughs> We'd be in a real pickle if we lost those pinwheel veins. I'm sure I have something in my toolbox that we can use to put them in back in place. I'll tell you, you really have a knack for steering up trouble, youngster. You haven't even reached the hollow tree, and the ghosts are already giving you a hard time. Stay strong, my boy. We have that dark moon back in the sky before you know it. Alright, so I guess in the next episode, we'll do, uh, B3. Well, then, how many levels are in this one? It goes up to A5, and then the boss. Also, there's a ghost. So, it says, get all the booze to unlock this mission. So, 
eventually we can do those bonus levels. We have to get all the boosts first, though. Which also means replaying levels. <laughs> so yeah, we'll figure that out later. Guess we gotta do a graveyard shift next episode. So hey, maybe if I'm lucky I can beat up- I can be beat up. I can beat Haunted Towers next episode. Who knows? Because there, I think half of this game, honestly, is probably going to come from, like, the cleanup at the end, where I have to get all the gems, and then get all the booze, and then there's bonus levels. There's just a lot of shit. Anyways, thanks for watching Luigi's Mansion 2. Make sure to like and subscribe to you on YouTube and Twitch. And, um, I'll see if I can do more of this game uh, tomorrow. We'll see. It depends how much time I have. I mean, I could probably do it at night, but you never know. Someone might bug me and ask to play with them. And I'm pretty sure uh, me and Jordan have to finish up, uh... Well, I don't know if we're gonna finish up, but we're definitely gonna play more um, Bloodstained 2 tomorrow. And, um... Me and Zeppi are gonna play Trash in the morning, because originally, me and Zeppi were supposed to play Trash this morning, but he said, no, I can't, and I ended up promising Elijah to play Trash, so I'm gonna play Trash two days in a row, I guess. I mean, it's whatever, I only play Trash for like an hour at a time anyways, and half the time it fucking crashes, so, whatever, it's not a big deal. But yeah, um, expect that in the morning.